Well, he's one of the most outspoken members of the LA City Council. Representing District 13, Councilmember Mitchell Farrell has a deep connection to his district, not only when he's at work, but also when he's off the clock. On our latest episode of Council Off the Clock, we find out what makes the council member tick. So you got your start mm -hmm. as a dancer, right? I was a professional dancer when I was in my 20s, yes. So professional dancer means? Uh, I did touring shows. I did uh, musicals, Broadway-style musicals. Right. Okay, so with that said, we got kind of the, your background. Mm -hmm. Let's look at some music. If I grab like something randomly out of here, have well, you let's grab it? this one. I haven't performed in this, but uh, do you know the song? It's a great, it's a great song. I know the song, all that jazz. Right. Yeah. Come on, babe, we're gonna paint the town. And all that jazz. Great. But as far as performing in these, um, I certainly have not been in Hamilton. Here we go. I have been in Oklahoma. You have. I certainly have. The one show I've seen on Broadway. Yes, I did Oklahoma. Andrea Martin as the aunt. Wow. On on Broadway. That's really cool. Oklahoma. That's great. So you come out here, and something has to change or switch in you to make you say, okay, I want to be mm -hmm. a politician. There was a transition from, I am tired of struggling in the arts, I'm struggling to make a living at times, to I want to do something meaningful. How can I make improvements in the communities I represent? How can I improve the quality of life? And how can I support the organizations, the nonprofits, the, the various community groups? All of the folks who want to accomplish the same thing, and that is, make our city better. I know how much this place means to you. Can you talk a little bit about what it means to Hollywood and why you want to keep it around? Amoeba is a brand that everyone supports and doesn't want to see go away. Right. So when this proposal came my way to close Amoeba and put a development here, um, that was not what Amoeba ever wanted. It's also a small business that employs dozens and dozens of people. Absolutely. And so it's a driver of the local economy and it provides jobs for people who live nearby. Well, and that's nice exactly the too. kind of thing that I like. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. So I know you gotta get out of here, you're gonna run, but the last thing I'm gonna do before mm -hmm. we go is I'm gonna buy you some Johnny Cash. I'm gonna do it right no now. No kidding. I'm gonna buy you some Johnny Cash. Now. All right. I loved his last recording and then his whole ring of fire with the Spanish trumpets, Mexican trumpets. My that. God, is that the best or what? And then when you think about it, that you think that uh, June wrote that. Phenomenal.